Well, visiting here with Miami Dolphins safety Walt Akins after the ball game. And uh, Walt, first chance playing in your uh, hometown since you got drafted into the NFL. How did it feel to go out there tonight and compete? Uh, it felt good. You know, we got, got friends and family here. But, uh, I mean, the main thing is I got my brothers here in this locker room, you know. Went out there to play a football game, um, showed some good things. We, we're going to get back to work next week. You went out there, you made a whole lot of tackles tonight. You played with a little bit of extra fire out there playing in front of your family and friends? Um, I feel like I just tried to play my game. You know, just go out there and, and, and play what we've been practicing uh, in OTAs, uh, training camp, and just, uh, just ball out. Coming out of Liberty last year, you know, you come in your first year in the NFL. Now in year two, how does it compare to last year? Um, it's totally different. You know, last year was more of a learning experience, uh, getting into the NFL, just learning the system, um, just seeing how, how much different it is from college. And uh, this year, I, I feel like I know a lot about it. And I'm out here trying to trying to master my craft. I, had, I got Lewis Delmas and uh, Rashad Jones in front of me. You know, the, those are the older veterans, and they, they just help me out and um, just, just teach me everything and, and stay on me constantly so I don't get complacent. And, I mean, I stay on myself as well. So we're making a group effort to, to be the best secondary, be the best defense, be the best team overall. Visiting with former Liberty Flames safety and Miami Dolphins safety now, Walt Akins, and you were competing against Mike Brown out there tonight as well. Your former quarterback, how did that feel? Oh, it's good, man. Uh, we've been practicing with them this whole week, so – uh, we had some some early words uh, during the week. This this game was just a uh, who can do it better type deal. So we, we were going at each other. I got to guard him a couple times, and I mean that that brought back old memories. A little friendly talking going back and forth between you guys. Oh yeah, of course, of course. <laughs> That's my boy. That's my boy. What do you feel like you need to do to improve individually here heading into year two? Um, just keep getting better. Uh, my thing is try to get better every day. Uh, learn something new from from everyone, my coaches, my, my veteran players. Uh, just just take it with stride and keep moving. Is there anything from college that you still apply to now here in the NFL? My aggressive, of course. You know, I like being being feisty, like being physical. I like to like to talk a little bit. You know, that's that's just a part of the game. And it's more so for me. It gets me fired up. And uh, I mean, that's just my style of play. Walt, how much are you still keeping up with the Liberty Flames? I keep up with all of them. Keep up with all of them. Uh, the ones that are still playing in the NFL and the ones that are not. The ones that are, are back home working. I'm still calling from time to time, checking up on them, make sure everything is all right. Um, we're, all a, we're all a football family. Yeah, Kevin Fox trying to make a roster up there in Pittsburgh, too. Oh, yeah, he's balling. Uh, I talked to Kevin a couple weeks ago. He's doing his thing. And uh, uh, my thing for him is, is just keep balling. Last thing, any message for the Flames fans back at home? Oh, man. Oh, man, hell you all day, baby. <laughs> all right, well, appreciate the time. Good luck here coming up in season two. Thank you. I appreciate that. Well,